The Newcastle Area School District says it has zero tolerance for threatening behavior by students or parents. Erica Stanish has more on why the district says it's necessary to put a new policy in place. The district says reckless or threatening behavior will not be tolerated, and that includes those acting out on social media. We saw some behaviors that weren't acceptable, and we wanted to address them. The Newcastle superintendent is working to make a change for the better when it comes to how students and parents behave within the district. After a recent rise in violence at schools across the country, the district has implemented a new policy stressing bad behavior will not be tolerated. I want them to know. We're not doing this in Newcastle. The district says this includes yelling, swearing, or hostile behavior of any kind, or you could be criminally charged. We look at each incident individually and see what the violation would be. If it's a violation of the Pennsylvania Crimes Code, we would charge accordingly. The Newcastle police chief says there's been an increase in cases lately, but says the biggest issues stem from social media and TikTok challenges. My son told me, yeah, there was one day where they are tearing the uh, soap dispensers off the walls, which don't know why. Katie Kay talked with parents Tuesday who say the policy is long overdue. Some saying threats against teachers have gone too far. They're here to teach. They're not here to, to, to get threatened and to have, you know, things done to them. Um, so I think it's kind of a good idea. Just it's all about control. Whatever the school needs to do to crack down on this, I will support them as long as it's in, you know, the right means. <laughs> The district says their main goal is to keep students and staff safe and believe that this new policy will be a proactive approach to keeping all parties focused and following the rules. In Newcastle, Erica Stanish, KDK News.